Hey guys, what's going on? It's vault -Tech Armor. Today we're going to be talking about the Simulor weapon in Warframe. Now, this weapon can be acquired through the Cephalon Samaris for 75,000 rep, which is a syndicate in, within Warframe, or you can just purchase it from the market for, I believe, 210 plat. But you can get that down if you have a, say, 50% or 75% off card, which if you don't have the time to buy it from the Cephalon Samaris to get all the rep, then you could go ahead and buy it from the market. Now starting off, this is an assault rifle that does a base magnetic damage of 50. Its crit chance is 10%, which is not very high, but you can get it higher through mods. And it comes with a D and a dash polarity. And once again, you can add polarities through the polarization option once you hit level 30 with the weapon. You can polarize it, puts it back to rank 0. But once it's upgraded, it will be that much more powerful. It also has an ability called Merge that does 170 to 200 damage, and this is an AoE effect. This can be activated by shooting 5 bullets in a similar proximity to each other. This will cause a, quote, Merge or Void. Now this can be lowered down to 3 if you customize it with mods. So now I'm going to show you guys my current mod setup which took me about 4 days because I used 4 formas. So with this setup I was able to get my previous 50 magnetic damage all the way up to 829 and my stack damage which is the merge damage up to about 2000. So starting off I put serration which is a must have mod for pretty much any weapon that's an assault rifle and it basically adds damage. Next we have stormbringer and as well as car rounds this adds to my magnetic damage. Then we have Heavy Caliber, which is yet again another must-have, and the accuracy is not really going to affect this weapon because you're not going to notice it. Next we have Split Chamber. Now this is the mod that's going to be able to let your merge go down to three shots instead of five. And then we've got Speed Trigger and Vile Acceleration, which basically is going to help you with your fire rate, which is definitely a must-have for this weapon because it does have a very slow base shooting damage. And then finally we've got Metal Auger which gives you a good punch through which is going to be important for this weapon because without it your bullets will just bounce off enemies instead of going where you want them to go so that's very vital to this weapon. Definitely recommend you get this mod. Now if you guys don't think this weapon's powerful yet you haven't seen the last of it. Now we're going to talk about the Mirage Warframe in incorporation with this weapon. So without the Mirage's first ability Hall of Mirrors, your Simulor is going to create vortexes in a minimum of three shots. But if you have this ability activated with this Warframe, it will create vortexes in just one shot. That means you can have up to 10 vortexes per clip. In fact, you could probably have about 20 vortexes on the field before your ability runs out and then you can reactivate it. So if you guys get this Simulor, I definitely recommend you go for this Warframe and I have a video up about this Warframe that I uploaded two days ago I believe so definitely check that video out if you have not already. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to Vault Armor for more frequent uploads. So until next time, thanks for watching.